Keep waking up now, now. Rising up, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Babylon, you hypocritic enemy. You create more problems than you got the remedy. You misleading and deceive my people endlessly. Then you wonder why I never want you next to me. Your civilians are like slaves linked in servitude. And the only way to keep them is to keep them from the truth. While your institutions keep indoctrinate the youth. We hear you speak of hope and change, but you leave no proof yet. Babylon, you're smart now, this is more than true. But when the people wake on up, they'll come straight after you. We have young men, women, children coming after you. Life with you is an illusion, not reality. And for anyone who names a peace, you name insanity. You subdue my people with stories of fantasies, false governments, false courts, false authorities, and myths. Iration, all nations, one people, one destiny. Well, yeah, Iration, all nations, one people. One destiny. Babylon, you are a sickness to society. There is no other that can claim a notoriety. With all your chemical concoctions of variety, what you really seek is for my people to go quietly. But what they're really getting ill from is your mind control. It has diminished our intelligence and numbed our souls. Manipulation of the masses is your only goal. You may have succeeded, but the difference is now we know. So what you gonna do without our energy? Cause now we're using it to make a brand new energy. Yeah, we infuse our meditation, our philosophies, learning to transcend beyond the realms of this reality. So Babylon, it's over, it's time to go. Oh, when foundations are rotting, you can go no more. So let your eyes and set your sights upon that door. And get the fuck out of our lives, don't come back no more in this. Iration, all nations, one people, one destiny, well yeah. Iration. All nations, one people, one destiny, well, yeah. Music's the healer, the healer. Music's the healer, yeah, she's the healer, the healer, the healer. Oh, she's the healer in this iration. Oh, yeah, all nations, one people, one destiny. Yeah, one people. All the people out there that are trying to spread love and peace, keep doing what you're doing. Because we need it so badly right now. With all the people out there with the rage and the anger, it's totally accept. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's totally valid. There's a reason to be angry. But you're feeding it. You're feeding that dark energy that you're so against. You're fighting violence with violence. Right now, we need to, we need to fight with love and light. That's the only way we're going to get out of this. This has been happening for centuries and centuries, and it's time to break a cycle. We're not breaking a cycle by feeding them and fighting them with what they've given us. No. The violence and the hate and the crime. That's not how we're going to win this. We're only going to win with love. True, pure, unconditional love. Hurt people hurt people. How often have you hurt somebody and you didn't mean to, but you hurt someone because you've been hurt, you know, love people. Where is the love? By the way, the song that I just sang was by Natalie Rise. Look her up. All right. Beautiful black woman. But you know, that doesn't even really matter. 
the people that aren't posting things right now about Black Lives Matter are being called racist. Black people who are posting and talking about uh, how this is not right and that we shouldn't be out there vandalizing and protesting and this is not the right way, those black people are getting called racist. They're getting asked if they grew up in white privileged neighborhoods and lost their culture. That's not right. Okay? The people that are preaching love and peace and saying that everyone's equal and that we all need to just stand together and stop attacking each other, those people are getting called racist, white privilege. That's fucked up. Okay? That's not how we're going to win this. We are on the same team. We need to stop attacking each other. We need to speak our truth. And that's what I'm doing right here, right now. And I know I'm going to get a lot of hate for this. And that's okay. Because this is what we do in the light. This is what light workers do, what light warriors do. This is how we're going to win the world. This is how we're going to shift a paradigm and stop living the way we have been. And we're going to move cycles. And we're going to come together. And it's going to be beautiful. But people, we need to wake up. Okay? We need to... We need to stop fighting hate with hate. That's what hate wants. It wants you to feed it. The more you feed it with your energy, the more existent it becomes. Energy goes where intention or energy flows where intention goes. So as, if you put all your focus on all the bad shit that's going on in the world, you're only making it exist more in your life. That's why a lot of people aren't on Facebook and Instagram right now and social media. That's why a lot of people are at home and meditating and praying because this is not what they want to feed. They're trying to stop this. It's not that they don't care. It's that that's the way to go right now. We need to get off social media first of all. That's that's a big part of this. This is being fed and we are being manipulated. The masses are being manipulated right now. This is all over the world. Stop letting them control your mind. We can't do this anymore. It's time to break a pattern. It's time to break the cycle.